Hi guys, hi warriors. So I have for you this week Zivau number 65 and it's a butt week again and it's our last butt week number four so we're focusing on our butts and I have an amazing workout for you guys. For all of you who don't have any equipment at home, it's all body weight exercises for your butt, for your glutes and hamstrings or you know if you go somewhere on the road trip or you know, if you're traveling and you just don't have any equipment other than a chair, you're gonna need a chair, that's the only thing that you need. It's a very practical workout and very effective. I chose the most effective exercises that will target this area of your body. So, before we start, I just wanted to tell you guys about my new DVD. It's a yoga DVD and it's a very dynamic kind of yoga. It's power yoga. And on this DVD, you can find six absolutely awesome yoga workouts that will stretch and tone your entire body. So you're not gonna be just stretching, but you're gonna be burning tons of calories and you're gonna be strengthening your body as well. You can get this DVD on my website, zuskalai.com. You can buy it on Amazon as well. So far, we're shipping to United States and, so, and we're gonna be shipping soon to Europe and to Canada and everywhere again. That's all. Now, the first exercise in this workout is one leg squat. It's also called pistols and it's a very advanced exercise but very, very effective. It's great for, uh, for your legs and for your butt, for your core as well. So I suggest that you practice this exercise at home as much as you can because you're gonna really find it effective. So stand on one leg, all of the muscles in the leg are tight, squeeze your glutes, squeeze your abs, extend the other leg in front of you. And now push your hips back and go all the way down until your butt, uh, you know, touches almost your calves all the way down. And then from here, you're going to push off of the standing heel. You're going to stand up and now push your hips forward and squeeze your glutes. Now for beginners, it takes time to practice this exercise, to learn this exercise. But for you guys, what you can do is that you can hold onto a chair when you're doing this exercise. You know, it's much better for your balance. Just push your hips back, you know, keep reminding yourself what you're supposed to do. Tensing all of the muscles, pushing your hips back, keeping it on, on your heel, keeping your back uh, as straight as you can. You know, don't let your back round like this. Try. You know, even if your back is not going to be completely straight, just try your best to focus on that. And then this is going to help you to even stand up if you're holding on to something. Or another variation is you're going to start by sitting on the chair and you're going to push off of the heel and stand up and then you're going to sit back down. That's an easier modification for beginners. And even that move, even if you don't go all the way down, if you're sitting on a chair, this still is a great exercise for your butt. So, <laughs> I just stumbled a bit. So you're gonna stand up and squeeze the butt. Great exercise. So, what we're doing in this workout, we're gonna do five reps on each leg. The next exercise is a very dynamic cardio exercise, also targets your butt. It's called vertical leap. So what you do is that you're gonna push your hips back, get ready, keep your back straight, and you're gonna jump up, driving your hips forward, squeezing your glutes, you're gonna jump up. So you have to really pay attention. It's not just like a jump like this. You're basically driving your hips forward, squeezing your glutes when you're jumping up. So again, push your hips back, jump up, squeeze your glutes. And we're doing 10 reps. Then we're gonna move on to the next exercise, for which one you're gonna need this chair again. And you're gonna put the top of your foot on the chair, on the edge of the chair. Keep your back straight, chest up, shoulders back and down, abs tight, and you're gonna lunge down until the thigh is parallel to the ground. You're gonna stand up, take the foot off of the chair, touch the ground, keeping your back straight, abs tight again. Touch the ground, hips forward. 
and that's, that counts as one rep. So you're doing two moves. You're doing the lunge down, and then you're doing one leg deadlift. Touch the ground forward, and then put the leg back on the chair. And we're gonna do 10 reps on each leg. The fourth exercise in this workout is side jump lunge. One of my favorite cardio exercises. So, you're gonna get into the side lunge position. So, lunge sideways and push your hips back at the same time. So, this leg is straight. This leg, this thigh is parallel to the ground as much as you can. Touch the ground, keep your back straight. And now, as you power up, as you jump up, you have to drive your hips forward again so that you feel the squeeze in your butt. So what matters here is that you push off of your heel with power so that you jump up and that you get to squeeze your butt as you jump up. So again, jump and then touch the ground again. Jump and touch the ground. So it's important that you really power up when, as you're jumping. And we're doing 20 reps. The next exercise is gonna be on your exercise mat. So lay down on your back. And one of the most effective exercises for your butt is bridge. And if you do one leg bridge, it's even better because then you're increasing the challenge. And I suggest that you grab your knee when you're doing the one, one leg bridge. Grab your knee because that's gonna put more strain on your glutes instead of your hamstrings. And that's, that's what you need. If you really wanna focus on glutes, then grab your knee and then push off of the heel and bring your hips up. Squeeze your butt and then bring it down again. And then repeat. So we're doing 10 reps on each leg like this. Then you're gonna get up and you're gonna do last exercise for which you're gonna use the chair again just for support. And we're doing these uh, leg lifts. So you're gonna hold onto a chair, you're gonna do side leg lift and back lift. So you're kicking your leg behind you, lifting, squeezing your butt again, and you're gonna raise the leg sideways again. That counts as one rep, and we're gonna do 20 reps on each leg, so it's gonna look like this. One, two, and then you're gonna, you're gonna complete 20 reps, then you're gonna switch legs, and that's the entire circuit, and we're gonna, co we're gonna repeat the circuit three times. So focus on your form, but try to complete this workout as fast as you can. That's your goal, and that's it. Now I'm gonna post the real-time workout uh, later, later this week, because right now I'm gonna do this workout myself in a real time, so you can see real sweat and real effort. And later this week, if you want, you can try this workout with, with me, rep by rep. And if you like, you can try this workout right now at home, uh, because you know exactly what it is. You know the workout breakdown, you know the proper form. So why don't you try it yourself and then let me know how you did. And that's it, and I'll see you guys next time. Ciao. Thank <laughs> you.